then we find the average. Let me explain what I've just said. Um, you are not fixed to do it three times. You can even do it once, but try to be accurate. You can do it two times. You can do it three times. The more you do many times, the more accurate your value may be. So the first one, you measure, you just allow the thread to go round. 
Although we, we can use uh, what we call we can use a micrometer screw gauge, but now I want us to approximate what we will do. I would simply take the whole of the book with all the pages, use a roller, or I use a finer caliper, but now because you are stealing for money, you've not uh, learned about finer caliper, use a roller, get the length. For example, now in this case, it is telling me.
knowledge it is still approximation now this one is now an approximation method so first of all i will show you look at what i, I have there
have a sphere for example a football it is 4 over 3 pi r cubic 4 over 3 pi r cubic we have a cone 1 over 3 pi r square h 1 over 3 pi r square h there is a height running from the tip to the bottom down there uh, then we have examples question of questions now I, want to, I, I just read for you uh, but you don't want to do it I just advise you to work on them until uh, you know to see 
the radius of the sphere, which is 6 over 2, that is 3 millimeters, we can get the volume of the sphere by applying the re uh, relevant formula 4 over 3 by r cubic. We get the volume of the sphere, which is also the volume of the cylinder, that is in the form of a wire, or a wire in the form of a cylinder. Particular city.
la solide. The volume rises to volume 2. Why did it rise from V1 to V2? Because a solid was immersed in it. So now the volume of the solid would be V2 minus V1. Let's read at the bottom of the map. 